this leads me to make a feeble attempt at reading something. <laughs> you say they won't let me be the most powerful man on earth. I'm told to be patient while you find time to knock down doors for those who don't look like me. It reminds me of the saying, a face in a high place. The day you gain power, no radio black outlet, no, excuse me, no radio talk outlet to hear a black voice. Air America crushed the Negro point of view. Liberals felt they could speak a more fluent form of Ebonics. The sad thing is, you look like me, but I feel you're ashamed. The inauguration should have featured a black designer. They know her body. I, I hope you get what I'm saying. <laughs> this is not meant to take away from the many talented designers who weren't born in the rhythm section. You tell spooks they should take care of their kids. You don't complain about how their jobs are given to people who are benefiting from legislation designed to make amends for slavery. I'm sorry, I gotta tell it like it is. And besides, I, I'm gonna edit, edit, editorialize for a second. The fact is that you never hear what blacks feel. There's, you turn on your radio in New York City with a Negro in the White House, and the fact is we don't have a voice. He isn't a bad person, but he is not a president for black people, black Americans, I should qualify that. You, uh, you don't complain about how their jobs, and I'm repeating this, you don't complain about how their jobs are given to people who are benefiting from legislation designed to make amends for slavery. Remember, white women benefited most. They later sued in the Supreme Court to close the door. Think about it. Your voice is silent while dope is flooding our youth's brains. Pot's a drug that may not be the worst, but can the poor and the disenfranchised afford the luxury of living on a cloud? There is more to black America than hip hop. Think about it. Who does he fight to the White House? There's blues. I gotta go to white people to find out about blues. To figure that out. <laughs> She grows organic veggies, but you were accused of hesitating on labeling genetically modified food products, eliminating consumer choice. I'm from the streets of New York City. They won't let you do something specifically for brothers and sisters. You're on your way out. Let us know you've read our past. Clean up Chicago, Newark, Baltimore, New York, etc. Haiti, Africa. At least Americans can help you create a real legacy for the people. Thank you. Wow.